Okay, welcome back to my new video. Um, today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how you can execute shell script and uh, maybe Python script inside your Golang um, application. So let's jump right into the IDE. Um, I'm already in the IDE. Um, I'm going to create a new um, directory called shell dash script. Okay. Inside that um, directory, I'm going to create a file called main.main. I'm going to create another file called app.sh. Um, the last one app.py. So inside the app.sh, I'm going to use the shebang. And then I'm going to echo hello world into a file, which um, I'm going to use this absolute path. Okay, so I'm going to call it out dot out. Okay. And then inside my app dot py, I'm just going to print inside Python. Okay, that's all I just want to print. So now I'm inside my main Go application. I'm going to make use of the OS library. So let me import the package, import OS slash exec. And then I'm going to say exec.command. Then I'm, I'm going to pass bin forward slash ZSH. And then I'm going to pass up dot SH dot output. And then once I do that, um, Once I do that, um, this returns, let's call it CMD as well as the error. So let me handle the error. If the error is not equal to nil, we want to log this fatal error. Else we want to just print CMD, which is a command. And then we finally print done. Okay, so that is all to the code to execute this um, app.sh. So I'm just going to click on the green button and run this Go application. As you can see, it's printable done. And once we see inside our shell script folder, you can see out dot out. Okay, so when I double click, you're gonna see hello world. If I run this program again, it's going to append another hello world to this out dot out. Okay, just for the fact that I did this double pipe. So this double pipe or this double arrow means that they should append to this entire file. Okay, so let's try for the app.py. So I'm just going to replace this. 
Okay, let me just copy and then just comment out so that you can see the difference. So I'm just going to comment out this. So what I'm just going to do is, this is the command Python, and then we pass in app.py. Okay, so everything stays the same. Okay, so I just change this bin forward slash zsh to Python, and then I change the sh dot sh to dot py. So let's run this. So as you can see, it prints what inside Python, and then it prints um, done. This done is coming from the Golan, and this one is coming from the Python file. Okay, so that is all to it. Um, if you have any question, don't forget to leave your comments in the comment section below. And then I'm going to respond to your, your questions as soon as possible. Don't also forget to subscribe to my channel and share the video and hit on the like um, button. See you in the next one.